Hey everyone, my name is Andrea. I am back with another movie reaction. I will be continuing my journey into 80s movies with The Terminator. I have never seen any of the Terminator movies. The only thing I know is that Arnold Schwarzenegger plays a robot. So that will be very interesting to see. So far, I have reacted to, I have begun reacting to the Rocky franchise, as well as Indiana Jones and the Marvel Cinematic Universe with Iron Man. So if you have not had the opportunity to check those out, uh, go ahead and do so. I will get right into the reaction action to Terminator. But before I do that, please, if you're enjoying this content, please give it a like, subscribe to the channel. We do also have a Patreon where you can catch all of our full unedited movie and TV reactions well in advance of the YouTube uploads. Oh, 2029. Wow. So this is in the future, even for now. This is really futuristic. Ooh. Okay, so it looks like we have a war of machines. Or a war between machines and people. Looks like the machines were coming out on the good end of that. So it's 2023 and the movie's set in 2029, so it only has six more years. So I guess Arnold will be the Terminator. Okay, we're back to 1984. Quite the time jump. What the hell? So I guess the machines are invading or going to be invading. Oh. Oh, there he is. Wow, he looks so young there. Arnold Schwarzenegger? Wow. So where did he come from? Oh, he's naked! <laughs> oh my god. They could have at least clothed him. Wash day tomorrow. Nothing clean, right? <laughs> Nothing clean, right. So he just repeats what they say. Six pack. Your clothes. Give them to me, now. Or maybe not. <laughs> oh, those knives are not gonna work. <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh! Oh, gross! <laughs> oh, gee. So the electricity is what causes him to show up. Ooh. What happened to his back? Hey! I said hold it! Oh. <laughs> so they're gonna arrest him for taking his pants. <laughs> What day is it? Thursday. What year? <laughs> well, I guess he didn't get that information that he wanted. <laughs> well, I guess he uh, found a way to get clothes in the middle of the night. I thought he would steal the police car there.
So I hope we find out more about who these guys are and why they're being sent to Earth. I assume they're robots or some sort of a cyborg. It looks like they're being sent back in time because he didn't know which year it was. Oh, phone books. <laughs> Do the... Oh. Phone books haven't existed for a while. I don't even know if they exist. Sarah Connor, so she's obviously important. Oh, there's Arnold again. He's got clothes. Oh, ouch. That's Italian. You can go pump or auto. The 45 long slide with laser siding. These are brand new. We just got the. I don't know anything about guns. The Uzi 9mm. Oh, your weapons, buddy. Hmm. Any one of these is ideal for home defense. <laughs> That's not what he's thinking of. There's a 15 day wait on the handguns, but the rifles you can take right now. Mm -hmm. You can't do that. Oh my god! Yeah, I would not argue with him. <laughs> I'd let him just take whatever you want, buddy. Just don't shoot me. Okay, so this must be another... another cyborg. I don't know how he's related to Arnold Schwarzenegger, whatever his name in the movie is. I don't care what you're doing, come and get me! What the- oh, <laughs> oh, he's looking up Sarah Connor. Okay, yep. So, I wonder why he's looking her up. I guess we'll find out. Sarah Connor? Yes. <gasps> Ooh! Okay, that's Sarah Connor. Oh! Once again, Sarah Connor, 35, mother of two, brutally shot to death in her home this afternoon. <sighs> You're dead, honey. Okay, so it was another woman called Sarah Connor. I wonder if he was looking for the waitress and he found a different... She accidentally shot a different one. Hmm, I want to know who this guy is and what his deal is. Because he also landed naked on the street, along with Arnold, in a different location, but they were both, they both came to, came to 1984 in a lightning storm, so obviously they've gone forward in time, or back in time. They're from the future. So this looks like a, a flashback or a flash forward. Looks like we're back in 2029, it is. So some sort of machine is shooting at these guys. Oh my gosh, that guy just evaporated. Oof. Looks like he got crushed. Better hurry up. So that was a flashback to 2029. <laughs> Sounds kind of funny saying that. Ed. What do you got? Dead girl. I can see that. 
Sarah Ann Connor, secretary, 35, shot six times at less than 10. What's this? I think he got the wrong Sarah Connor. Dead girl, too. Sent over from the Valley Division this afternoon. Look at the name, Ed. Sarah Louise Connor. Is okay. this right? So he's killing everyone called Sarah Connor? It's interesting seeing all the older technology in this movie with the cars and the motorbikes and the answering machine and the the headphones. It's funny because I don't remember any of it, but... <laughs> Okay, so this is the other guy following her, it looks like. Police have announced the name of the victim in the second of two execution-style murders which took place today. Incredibly, the names of the two victims are virtually oh. identical. Two hours ago, 35-year-old Sarah Ann Connor was pronounced dead at the scene in her Santa Monica apartment. Now, police are refusing to speculate on the apparent similarity between these shooting deaths, and no other connection between the two victims has been established as of yet. Yeah, I'd be scared. <laughs> I'd get home and lock the doors and turn off the lights and hide in the basement. Oh, is she next on the list? Yikes. So I wonder if this other guy is trying to protect her. He's either trying to protect her or he's also trying to kill her along with Arnold. Hey, you got a phone? It's in the back. Hey, 450. 450 to use the phone? Yikes. Emergency number. All our lines are busy. If you need a police car sent out to you, please stay on the line. <laughs> well, I can't send a police car. Well, I guess they could send a police car to the dance club. Oh, there he is. Good thing she's out. Oh no, there. That other woman is in trouble, and her boyfriend. Uh oh. I'm really scared for her. I'm just dancing along, having a good time, and oops, here comes Arnold. Ah! No! Oh, jeez. Oh, her lizard. <laughs> Aww. Oh. oh! Don't make me bust you up, man! Or Matt? Oh, 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 she is so much in trouble. Ah! Oh! Get out of there! Oh. Oh, no. I don't think he's going to give her mercy. Find something, but... Oh! Hi there. I, I, I fooled you. You're talking to a machine. <laughs> he didn't shoot the answering machine? Oh, he thought he killed Sarah. Oh, shoot. It's her. Sarah Connor? It's Lieutenant Traxler. Look, I'm in this bar called Tech Noir. Yeah, I know it. It's on Pico. 
Are you all right? Yeah, but I don't want to leave. I think there's a guy following me. I'll give you the restroom. I'll have a car there in a hot minute. Okay. Hmm. I wonder who will get there first, Arnold or the police? Oh, there he is. Is she really safe there with him there? I don't think so. Oh no. Oh shoot. She is in so much trouble. Oh no. I would run. Oh. I would get out of there, Sarah. Oh, she thinks it's him. Oh, shoot. Here he comes. Sarah, get out of there. Oh, my goodness. This guy's going to rescue her. <gasps> oh, my God. Okay, so I guess getting shot doesn't kill him. This is crazy. So much for being safe in a dance club. Uh oh. Oh no. Ah. Oh. He rescued her again. Come with me if you want to live. Okay, so he's the good guy. He's obviously trying to protect her for some reason. Save her from Arnold. I don't think he has a gun. Okay, so that's... Okay, that's interesting. He kind of sees like a... Like a robot, I guess. Wonder if he's fireproof. I guess we'll find out. Oh yeah. Ah! Oof. Ah. Oh. Ah. Okay, get out of there. Oh, ouch. I guess he's not so easy to kill. It must be the robot part of him. He's pretty indestructible. Hopefully they don't think the police car is actually the police. I'm here to help you. I'm Reese, Sergeant Techcom, BN38416, assigned to protect you. You've been mm -hmm. targeted for termination. <laughs> In English, please. <laughs> I didn't do anything. No, but you will. It's very important that you look. Terminator. Cyber 9 Systems Model 101. Mm. A machine? Like a robot? Not a robot. <laughs> Cyborg. Get your head down! Oh! I wonder if he thought that was a cyborg. Are you saying it's from the future? <laughs> she must be so confused. Then you're from the future too, is that right? Right. Right. Mm. Cyborgs don't feel pain. I do. Don't do that again. Oh! Just let me go. It can't be bargained with. It can't be reasoned with. It doesn't feel pity or remorse or fear. And it absolutely will not stop, ever, until you are dead. Wow, that's terrifying.
Yeah, you can see how he kind of does look robot-like. Reese, why me? It's a good question. It was a nuclear war. Mm. A few years from now. It was a machine, Sarah. Defense network computers. Mm. Then it saw all people as a threat, not just the ones on the other side. Decided so like a, micro a renegade computer. But there was one man who taught us to fight, to storm the wire of the camps, to smash those metal motherfuckers into junk. <laughs> His name is Connor. John Connor. Your son, mm. sir. Your unborn son. Wow. Okay. That makes sense. So then why is he killing all the other Sarah Connors? He doesn't know which Sarah Connor will give birth to John? Oh. Ah! Get out of there! So how do you stop this guy, then? That's what I'd like to know. There must be a way to kill him, or... stop him somehow. Stop just in time. Well, here come the real police. They're gonna be in trouble, but at least they won't be exterminated. No, Reese! No! 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 They'll kill you. Drop your knee! Drop to the ground. Hope they don't decide to shoot him anyways. Where's the cyborg? It's probably left. Oof. Okay, so it looks like he lost an eye, or he's got a black eye. So I guess he can incur damage. Well, some damage. Oof, okay. He definitely has a few wounds there. Oof. Oof. I don't want to see that. Yeah, keep that off screen, please. Oh. Okay, so... So what Reese said is true. He's computer inside and human on the outside. From 21 to 27. That's the year 2027. <laughs> oh no! Don't tell him that, Reese. They're not gonna believe you. <laughs> Kill Connor then. Why this elaborate scheme with the Terminator? It had no choice. Their defense grid was smashed. We'd won. Skynet had to wipe out his entire existence. Connor sent me to intercept, and they blew the whole place. Well, how are you supposed to get back? I can't. <laughs> Not now. Nobody goes home. Oh, no, don't take a scalpel to your eye, please. Oh, no. <laughs> No, I'm not good with this. Uh, Rose. Oh. oh. Oh, God. Looks like a contact lens. Oh, wow. Okay, so that's the machine eye underneath. But he can't grow another human eye? He can't just walk around in public looking like that. Oh, okay, there's the... <laughs> yes, there's the solution. Look cool and escape notice. Why didn't you bring any weapons? Something more advanced? Don't you have 
Ray guns? <laughs> Ray guns? <laughs> Why were the other two women killed? Most of the records were lost in the war. Skynet knew almost nothing about Connor's mother. Her full name, where she lived, they just knew the city. Mm. The Terminator was just being systematic. Uh -huh. He'll find her! That's what he does! That's all he does! You can't stop him! He'll wait for you, reach down her throat, and pull her fucking heart out! Oh, ouch. That's brutal. Wow, okay. Sleep. <laughs> yeah, I may not look it, but that couch is very comfortable. No, it does not look comfortable at all. I got 30 cops in this building. Mm, no, that's not safe. He could blow, th uh, Arnold could blow through 30 cops uh, in like two minutes. So I don't think she's safe anywhere. That's the uh, scary thing about this. Oh my god, there he is! Yep, just just what I said. She is not safe. Where is she? Look, it may take a while. I wanna wait, there's a bench over there. <laughs> He's not gonna wait. <gasps> I would not be telling him that. I'll be back. Mmm. That's a famous saying. That becomes a famous saying, I think. That's how he comes back. Okay. Oh. Yeah, you don't, um... Uh-oh. You don't tell Arnold no. Oh, Sarah, get out of there. Oof. Yeah. 30 cops. Mm. Oh, jeez. Oh, this guy is unstoppable. I don't know if hiding under a desk was going to help you. Oh man, I'd be so terrified just knowing all those other... All the police officers are getting shot and knowing that you're next. Oh! Oh my god. <gasps> He'll just blow the door off. He doesn't need to open the lock. Or punch through the window. Okay. Where is he? Reese. You got a first name. Kyle. Kyle. So I passed right through the vein. You. Oh, this is gonna make me puke. Yeah, me too. Tell me about my son. It's about my height. He has your eyes. I die for John Connor. At least now I know what to name him. <laughs> oh, was it John that sent you here? I volunteered. Why? There's a chance to meet the legend. <laughs> You're talking about things that I haven't done yet in the past tense. It's driving me crazy. Yeah, it's definitely in intriguing. <laughs> must be stronger than you imagine you can be. You must survive or I will never exist. Wow, that's powerful. I could definitely see those two falling in love. Oof. He doesn't look so hot. <laughs> you got a dead cat in there or what? <laughs> you, I love Lord. that. <laughs> oh. oh, 
hope that wasn't the same hotel or motel Arnold was staying at. I'm going out for supplies. Keep this. Well, I mean, a gun is good, but it doesn't really work against the Terminator. Oh, I can't tell you where I am, Mom. I was told not to say. Oh, but honey, I am worried sick here. Okay. Yes, go ahead. It's oh no, he's gonna somehow intercept that information, isn't he? I'm sure the Terminator can hear that. Yeah, I love you too, of course. Sweetheart. Oh, it was him calling. Oh my goodness. Okay. Oh. So he can imitate people's voices as well. Give me your address there. Uh oh, here he comes. It'll never be over, will it? Oh, that's depressing. Was there someone special? Hmm. They're gonna get together here. A girl, you know. <laughs> No. no, she's definitely digging him. John Connor gave me a picture of you once. It's very old. Torn. Faded. I came across time for you, Sarah. Mm. I love you. Aww. I always have. He loves her, but he can't act on it. Oh, okay. Aw. <laughs> yeah, I figured these two would hook up at some point. <laughs> Aw. She'd be a lot older than him in 2029, though. That was an intense scene. Oh, here he comes. Aww. That would be crazy, he just sees computer graphics and red. He just throws him out of the car. Ah, <laughs> oh, too bad they didn't have time to get the gun. Faster! Drive faster! Oof. Definitely at an advantage on that motorcycle. You can just weave in and out of traffic. That's not working. He just keeps driving through all the fireworks. Firecrackers. Oh, oh God. This guy is ruthless. Oh my god. Somehow drive him off the... There you go. Drive him over the bridge. Somehow. Ah! Oh. 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 oh, Reese is in bad shape. Oh, he better hurry before he... Oh, he wakes up quickly. Or I guess comes together quickly. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Oh, 
he'll probably kill him. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Oh. Get oh out. my god. <laughs> oh, look at his face. Yeah, I would get out. Oh my gosh. Get him out of there! Yeah, that's just an explosion! Oh, oh my... You can't outrun that! Slowed him down. Okay, here we are. Ooh. Ah. That's oh my gosh. Thought she was gonna get hit with flying debris. Wow. Well, I guess we'll see if he's fireproof. Oh my god, how is he still? Oh my gosh, he just keeps coming. Well, if his flesh melts off, then maybe the computer, the computerized parts will melt, too. Okay, so I guess he's not so fireproof. Oof. I still wouldn't be 100% sure that he's not dead. Or destroyed. I hope Kyle's okay. Although I have my doubts, but... Oh. Okay. There he is. Good. Oh. Oh. We did it, Kyle. I wouldn't be so sure of that. Oh. What? Oh my God. Oh no. You did not get him. That is crazy. He just transformed into, like, a machine thing? Or is that his his skeleton? I don't know if going into that building is gonna help. Nothing seems to help against this guy. <laughs> oh! Yeah, it's gonna be through in a minute. No, Kyle! Come on! Oh. Come on! No! Don't sacrifice yourself. I wonder what that criminal psychologist would say now if he could see all this going on. He wouldn't think Reese is too crazy. She doesn't want him to sacrifice himself for her. I don't think that does anything. Not, not for more than a second. Uh oh. Oh, jeez. Oh no. I'm worried for Reese. Another sparkly. He's okay! Wow, there you go. He's being blown to parts. I wonder if they can reassemble themselves into the machine again. I feel like some part of the Terminator is still alive. Oh, ouch. Aw. Oh. Ah! 
Oh. Oh, jeez. Oh, no. Oh. Oh. Ah. I knew he was not dead. Oh, that thing is the worst. Dragging its robotic guts along. <laughs> Must have to reprogram it somehow. Don't buy that he's dead this time. <laughs> he's been he's been destroyed three times and he still keeps coming. Oof, I wouldn't even want to touch that metal claw. Ugh. Aww. That sucks. Ugh. Tape seven, November ten. Where was I? What's most difficult for me is trying to decide what to tell you and what not to. Should I tell you about your father? Boy, that's a tough one. No! Oh. Will it affect your decision to send him here, knowing that he is your father? Oh, wow, that's crazy. If you don't send Kyle, you can never be. God, a person could go crazy thinking about this. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> we loved a lifetime's worth. Oh. Miran, Miran. Oh my good. Okay, that's where the picture came from. Wow. Wow. Okay. So that's the end. Um, it looks like she's gone to Mexico. I'm just going to pause it here. Wow, so that was a, a crazy twist at the end, knowing that Kyle is actually John's father. I just can't wrap my head around that. It's a paradox, or oh, there is some word for it. Time paradox or something, where the, the past and the future somehow work together in a crazy way, and if you change one, you change the other. So I guess, so Kyle is John's father, but John taught Kyle I guess John was a, I, I don't know what the word for it was, John was a sergeant um, or I guess a leader that Kyle respected. So I got the sense John was older than Kyle, but then if Kyle is John's father, I'm not sure how that works. I can't wrap my head around that. Um, so Arnold Schwarzenegger was great as the Terminator. Obviously he was the villain, but uh, he did a great part. He did a great, uh, he did a great job with that part. He just kept coming and coming and I still don't think that he's dead. There, obviously there is a Terminator 2 and uh, let me know if you guys want me to check that out. Just drop a comment. Um, I will definitely consider looking at that in the future and reacting to that because I, I love the Terminator. I had never seen it before, but it's something, it's a franchise that I'm definitely interested potentially in pursuing. And I want to see how um, Arnold Schwarzenegger comes back as the Terminator. I also want to see what happens to Sarah. It looks like she's gone to Mexico. And I want to say how heartbreaking it was about Kyle and the fact that he didn't survive. 
But it's also crazy that he's John's father. Hopefully we find out a little bit more about that back about that story and how it works, because I'm a little bit confused with the past, present um, time continuum. I'm not sure what the correct term is. And I guess we will see what happens next if we go forward with that. Either way, I will see you guys in the next video.